Hey church, today we're going to look at Psalm 31. And this Psalm is David praying for deliverance. I'm going to read the first eight verses to us. It says, In you, O Lord, I have taken refuge. Let me never be put to shame. Deliver me in your righteousness. Turn your ear to me. Come quickly to my rescue. Be my rock of refuge, a strong fortress to save me. Since you are my rock and my fortress for the sake of your name, lead and guide me. Free me from the trap that is set for me, for you are my refuge. Into your hands I commit my spirit. Redeem me, O Lord, the God of truth. I hate those who cling to worthless idols. I trust in the Lord. I will be glad and rejoice in your love, for you saw in my affliction and knew the anguish of my soul. You have not handed me over to the enemy, but have set my feet in a spacious place." And this psalm goes on to speak more as David does here. He, he declares God's goodness. He talks about his situation, but he then says, I trust you, God, you are good. I want to encourage us, church, that no matter what our situation is today, the same God that David praised is our God today. We can trust him. He's good. He's our refuge. He's the one that is for us and with us. As we go ahead in this psalm, I love verses 14 and 15. It says, but I trust in you, O Lord. I say you are my God. My times are in your hands. I wonder in the moment how, as life is a bit different, how many of us have looked at our watches and thought days are going longer, times feel slower. And uh, there's uncertainty. Sometimes in the future, we don't know what things hold. But this verse that says, I trust you, my God, my time is in your hands. I love that idea that we can actually declare the time is in God's hands. When things are going to happen, how they're going to pan out, what it's going to look like. We have a God we can trust and put our hope in and we can actually hand our time, our days over to him. So I want to encourage us church today to maybe meditate on those verses, verse 14 and 15, to be able to say, I trust in you. You're my God. My time is in your hands. We don't need to take it into our own control but we can trust him with whatever is happening now and into the future. Let me pray for us today. Well, God, we thank you that we can trust you. We thank you that you're our refuge, you're our rock, you're the certain one. And we thank you that our time is in your hands, Lord. Whatever we are looking at today and in the future, we give you control. And we know we can trust you with the now and the uncertainty and whatever is to come. No matter how long time feels, how slow it feels or how fast it feels, we give you the time and we ask that you would be Lord of our time, Lord of our days. We trust you, Jesus, and we declare this in your name. Amen. Have a great day remembering that it's all in God's hands. Bless you.